All right, you lemmings. Now that there's nearly 50,000 of you, I need to lay down some ground rules. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know if the audio sounds any good. I'm not a camera guy. Oh, it's just going all wrong. This channel exists for my own personal amusement and experimentation, and to teach and learn things about video production. This channel was not created for your entertainment. If you subscribe, you are simply along for the ride. Now, I'm glad to have you, really. <laughs> but you're not gonna get typical YouTube content from this channel. I don't have an upload schedule. Sometimes I go months without posting anything, and sometimes I post three really stupid videos in a single day. The only consistently high-ish quality content on this channel are my video editing tutorials, which I post because I genuinely enjoy helping people. This channel does not exist to make money. I am not trying to get lots of views and subscribers. I'm not trying to become independent from Linus Tech Tips, and I'm not even trying to build a demo reel. I spend more than enough time at work worrying about the success of Linus Tech Tips. I don't wanna do that here as well. Now, I do need a few thousand guinea pigs to run my experiments on, but I achieved that over a year ago. Mission accomplished. So if you subscribed because you just want more content like Barrier Skip, or my four hour long video editing tutorial, you might be really disappointed when you mostly get videos like this instead. Bike, bike, key, the bike, bike bags, bike, bicycle, bikes, yikes. Or this. Or this. Predator Frost Core! Or this. One month after the release of my greatest work to date, I started deliberately shitposting again. I didn't realize there was a word for that. And take a look at the comments that I incited. Some of these might be sarcastic, but others are definitely genuine. Lazy content, unsubbing. What the fuck is this, Taryn? Unsub now. What the fuck? Fucking useless shitpost. Imagine if I didn't post any tutorials and I never created barrier skip. High quality videos like that will inflate people's expectations. Again, if this is your attitude, you should unsubscribe. And if you ever see a comment like this on one of my videos, be nice and just give them a link to this video. The good news is most of you seem to understand that I'm just having fun and you're having fun with me. If this is your attitude, you should stay. Oh, hey, it rendered. Oh, great. Whew. It's all green there, baby. Now, you might be thinking, why don't I just put all these silly and experimental videos on a secondary channel? Oh, that sounds very reasonable. That's what CGP Grey does. Well, guess what? This is a secondary channel. Linus Media Group is my primary concern. But this here, this is not my job. So I don't have to care. And that is so liberating. I can do anything I want and I don't have to worry about money. It's great. This is how I imagine retirement will feel. Now, that's not to say that it's all gonna be shit posts. I have some incredible videos in the works. Some of them will take years. Some of them will take my entire life. And some of them might be impossible to finish. But the important thing to remember is that everything on this channel right now is here because I want it to be. I won't allow my audience or the almighty YouTube algorithm to dictate what videos I make. I really do hate this prompter. So after five days of consistently uploading low effort content, people have indeed been unsubscribing. But check this out, this is far more interesting. It looks like my overall views have gone up, right? But in fact, if you zoom in on the data, you'll find that the baseline views across all of my videos have gone down. Yeah, that's right. The YouTube algorithm is punishing me for releasing low quality content. As well it should, but I really feel like it's playing dirty when it takes views away from my other videos, some of which are actually quite good frankly. Anyway, it's amazing how many forces there are that try to get me to care about 
YouTube success. I've got offers from multi-channel networks, comments saying that I should quit my job and go solo on YouTube, and there's the constant siren call of that 100,000 subscriber plaque. I'll be honest, I want it, but I won't compromise the integrity of my content to get there. With all that said, let me share something with you. Working for Linus Tech Tips, I've learned quite a lot about how YouTube works, and I'm quite certain that if I release a video like this, where I appear to genuinely not care about my subscriber numbers, which is true, I'm still gonna get more subscribers than I will lose. <laughs> so based on past data from Social Blade, I'd say I'm gonna gain at least a thousand subs from this video alone. Let's see what happens. That's right, gerbils. This is just another one of my experiments. You know, I almost wish you could put a hard limit on subscribers. Like, you'd have to get onto a waiting list or something, and you'd have to wait for someone else to leave. I think people would be a lot more engaged, don't you think? I love reading all of your stupid and funny and insightful comments, and seeing how you guys take my ideas and make them work for you. Look, I've got a whole folder full of pictures of secondary keyboards. And look at these remixes. These are great. Keyboard shortcut, 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 shortcut to keyboard shortcut, shortcut on the subject of keyboard shortcuts. That's what I really want is an engaged audience. That's a lot more valuable than the subscriber number. All right, that's the end of the video. I'm sick of writing this out. Yeah, I scripted this one. I can't believe it. I'm actually reading this off of a damn teleprompter. Please leave a comment with your thoughts and don't forget to unsubscribe.